Hello everybody, welcome back to a new vlog. I have to admit, I have been hyping myself up to start this vlog all day. And we're finally there at half past, what is the time? Half past three? I can't tell time, I don't know my lesson rights. List the amount of things that are probably wrong with me from that statement. I know, there's probably a lot of things wrong with me. Ooh, I'm putting my jewelry on and I'm wearing quite a snazz dress not that you can really see it for the fact that it is so hot today i think it's like maybe 25 degrees or something like that maybe more which to some people is not going to sound like a lot but in the uk when you've got brick houses and no aircon that's a lot and i'm going to a dinner which is like cocktail dress dress code that kind of vibes i'm probably going to be sweating and that is why i've decided to go with this little like sheer black cami number just take my watch off this ruins Every shot that I need to leave ASAP. Okay. I have to admit something. I have a confession. So hard for me, <laughs> me to say. I am feeling so deeply insecure at the moment to the point where I almost wasn't leaving the house today. And sometimes this just happens. Do you know what I've often found? This happens a lot when I'm neglecting myself and just doing everything but all of the things that are good for me. I'm feeling a little bit insecure today and I have been for a while. It's actually why I just haven't been leaning towards vlogging as much recently. I have been really, really struggling. I don't want to be on camera. I don't want to take photos. Like we had to shoot a campaign yesterday and Ryan genuinely had to fully hype me up for it. It was for a body care brand. So I had to film my legs. That normally should be fine. It was not, it was, it was a lot. So yeah, I'm feeling very insecure at the moment. So if I'm just not super chatty, don't have like a lot of personality. If I am just not bringing the vibes, I'm so sorry. I can only apologize. I hope that we can just kind of like say it and move on. But also if you see me in social situations and I either don't look happy or I look kind of a bit like bunny in headlights, or I am not in content with my friends, but my friends are like vlogging or whatever. It's probably because I've chosen not to be in that content, not because they're leaving me out or there's drama or anything like that. Cause that's one of the things that makes me so nervous is if I opt out of something, I know people get a bit like, why isn't this person in it? And it kind of spirals. If you just see a lack of me at some points, just know that this is why. I feel like it's getting worse the older I get. Does anyone else have this? The sense of ego has completely gone and I'm now just like, why? Why do you watch me? What is? What am I doing? What is happening here? Yeah, so I'm fully spiraling. And uh, that is where we are at. That's the great start to this vlog. But anyway, let's go to London and I'll show you my outfit. Excuse the mess in here because it is just chaotic at the moment for so many reasons. But um, yeah, and the lighting is, yeah, it's not doing me any favors. However, I just really wanted to show you this outfit because given the fact that I'm not feeling great today, I actually do really like this outfit, this dress is an old favorite it's it's actually looking quite old now to be honest it's one of the ones from top shop when slip dresses first like became a thing again i just love it i just always feel really lovely when i wear it whether i dress it up or dress it down like sometimes i literally wear it under a jumper in the winter i could not recommend having a long black slip dress enough they're just so useful i've gone for my monica vinader earrings edge of ember gaia collection victoria necklace i will never be able to say that right my watch is back on because i just I need it to be on time. If I take it off, I am always late, guaranteed always late. And then I've got a Gaia collection bracelet as well. I lost my choker. I don't know where it is. I miss it. I'm wearing the bracelet. The bag I believe is from West 22. Really cute. Um, I've got this little flower. This is actually, this is from a H&M. I was gonna wear it around my neck as a necklace, but I could also put it around my waist and have it as a little belt, but then it kind of, it flops. Didn't look great as belt, but I might wear it as a necklace. Um, my only thing is I don't have a very long neck, so I was kind of just going to get the girls feedback and then decide whether I was doing it because I wasn't feeling super confident. And because of that, apparently I can't make my own decisions. That is the look. And then I've just got these June shoes on and I've got these little YSL sandals to wear up to London because I just feel like I'm going to get stared at enough as it is at the moment. In fact, I may take a cardigan um, either to just throw on for whilst I'm on the train because sometimes the trains get a bit chilly or I might just pop it over my shoulders but yeah I might wear a little cardigan because this just feels a bit much for 4 p.m. On that note, gotta go, bye. That was the most stressful journey of my life. I need wine, ASAP. Guys, we are doing the switcheroo. This is why you bring a giant bag. We have gotten into the cab looking like Coastal Grandmother and we are leaving looking 
Instagram. <laughs> Hi, Sue. How are you? <laughs> Hi, guys. We're a little bit late, so let's go. That is a lot of foundation. It's a good color. It's very nice with tea. Oh my god, I have food envy. I love how I've just been giving you drinking tips, but here we are leaving at 9.30. <laughs> find you a best friend that leaves early. <laughs> or find you a best friend that likes to leave at the same time as you. Yeah, you know what? We're, we, have, we have the eyes. Yeah. <laughs> I know when she gives me the eyes. Yeah. They mean many things, but I always know. <laughs> we can communicate a lot with looks. I am home. We are almost back to exactly where we started this vlog. Although I look much shinier, like the glow is real. I just sat catching up on the Kardashians whilst I was eating some food. Ryan was super sweet and he knows that when I go to events, it's not always the biggest portions and I, I'm a lover of huge portions, so he made me a second dinner. So, ooh, the fly. So yeah, I've just been eating this gorgeous bowl of like tofu rice. It was unreal, and catching up on the Kardashians because I think I have a couple of episodes that I need to watch. But I'm taking a break to take off my makeup and get ready for bed. But I wanted to show you quickly. I got some goodies from. Uh, the lovely Armani team. Number one, they gave me this lip color, which they put on me at the event. And it's really lovely. I haven't actually used this one before. It's called, it's 107. Um, I usually wear, I think it's 109. This is a slightly warmer version and they just like tapped it into my lip. And it's actually a really gorgeous neutral color, but like works actually quite well with my skin tone. And um, so that was super lovely. And the blush, the blush they used on me, it is unreal. I've got the shade 50 in the new Luminous Silk Glow blushes, the shade Euphoric, and it is so stunning. It's like a shimmery, warm, tanny pink. Like it's just got this lovely, almost like sun-kissed aspect to it when it goes on the skin. It kind of gives you that look of like when the sun has like warmed up your face a little bit. And I just think that it's so beautiful. So I'm gonna be using this tomorrow morning. I think it's a really lovely one to use over the blush that I have been using lately, which is the Rose Ink Blush in, I can't remember the name, it begins with a H. It's gorgeous. This is basically like like a powdery version of that but when I say powdery it's really not powdery like it almost looks like cream when it starts going on the skin it's just so stunning by the way sorry if my eyes are just like super blinky I am so tired I also got a shade of the eye tints in matte and I'm so happy about this because I have them in like shimmers but I don't have a matte one. Oh my god this looks so good yes that is an everyday me eye shade if there ever was one. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah, love that. Love. So yeah, those are some new bits from Armani Beauty. I don't know why I put them on, if I'm being honest, because I'm literally about to take my makeup off, but got a bit overexcited, didn't I? I got this off Amazon and it comes with the cuffs as well that are like a towel material and it stops the water running down your arms. I actually need to get those. There is nothing worse than water running down your arms when you wash your face. And also as a tanner, as a lover of fake tan. This is not only unreal for when I wash my face, but also just when I'm doing like housework, like emptying the dishwasher, there's always something with a bit of water on it that then runs down my hand and down my arm. Not anymore. Anyway, I think I've done the gun a bit. I need to just change out of this t-shirt two seconds. That's better. <laughs> that is so much better. 
Oh, these t-shirts, these long sleeve t-shirts are just the most comfortable thing I own. I have them in like short sleeve t-shirt form as well. They're so good, I will link them in the info box. If you're looking to invest in like a quality, super soft t-shirt, I couldn't recommend these more. They also wash super well as well. I just love them. And you know what? This might be, whoa, that's funny. Um, this might be where I leave you guys for a couple of days now because I am having the weekend off. It's Father's Day weekend. I have a really fun couple of days next week. Actually, next week in general, phenomenal phenomenal i am so looking forward to it so the next time you see me will be a few days in the future this clade of cleansing room it's lovely good morning everybody it is so sunny I'm very excited for today because we're going to see Victoria and Alex and Amelia is coming as well. We're all going to, up to Victoria and Alex's house and having a little sleep over there and just a little chill. I'm hoping the weather holds out. It's really nice down here, but you just never know. But yeah, hopefully the weather holds out for us today. This is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing a Zara waistcoat and then Zara, of course, Zara trousers as well. My YSL tan flats and then this west 22 bag which you will have seen me wear the other day i just decided to wear it again today and actually i think i'm also wearing the same jewelry as well and under this i have a little white bikini ready for when i get there in case it is nice and we can like sit outside i've also spent the morning making a lemon drizzle cake i'm sweating let me tell you, I am sweating. Honestly, having the oven on in like when it's warm is just not, it's not the vibe. We also tried making a gluten-free lemon drizzle. I tried making two. Uh, we tried making a gluten-free one for Amelia and it, honestly, I will show you a video clip of it. It was so bad. So that is a new challenge on my list is to perfect the gluten-free lemon drizzle cake, the vegan gluten-free lemon drizzle cake. I'm pretty sure it's not possible because I literally couldn't find one single Google result for it. Actually, no, I found one, but it basically said don't use coconut flour and that was all it had. So if anyone has any tips, I would love to hear them. But yeah, anyway, we are gonna get ready to hit the road now. But yeah, this is my outfit. So cute. I love the little flower on this bag. It makes me so happy. So we are on our way. Around it's, around yeah, this this might be slightly unsteady. We have been driving for the longest time, but we've actually started playing a really good game. Shush, Siri. Um, we've started playing a really good game. This lighting, by the way, is sensational. Um, so the game is Who Am I? but YouTuber edition. And I'm having so much fun with this that I thought that we could all join in together and hopefully you guys will enjoy this. So, it's your go. You think of one. Okay, okay. Am I from the UK? No. I'm gonna assume they're from the US, but we're not gonna use that as one of my questions because we only get 10 questions. Am I from the US? So I'm just gonna have to use it as one of my questions. You picked a really hard one for like now that we're on camera. The last one was no, me. No, I actually I haven't picked a really hard one. Am I from Canada? Yes. <laughs> Is it Alana? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I love playing this game. Okay, okay, I've got one. I'm ready. Sorry, I was uh, concentrating on driving. <laughs> As you should be. Are you from the UK? Yes. Are you male? Yes. Do you do is your soul content fashion based? No. Is your soul content gadget slash photography based? No. Okay. Do I know them personally? I'm gonna say. Or like, have I met them? I'm gonna say no. Have I met them? E met them? I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. So I thought it was them. Oh, it's not Mark. No. Would I, would I watch your videos? No. Okay, okay. Is it, is your content home based? Like, you, you know what I mean by that, right? Not the shop home based. <laughs> um, not, it's not about interiors, if that's what you mean. What was that? 
I don't know the person's name, but someone that you started watching recently. Oh, not Toby. Right, okay. Love you, Toby. Oh, so obviously I have to know of them. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Okay, it's getting a bit tricky now. I thought I would have got it now. Um, so it's not interiors, it's not fashion, it's not like gadgety photography. Have you ever done daily vlogging? Mm-hmm. Is it Alfie? Yeah. <laughs> It's hard, even with like obvious people. That is the game that we have been playing. I hope you enjoyed playing along with us. But that has killed, I think like 15 minutes for us, at least maybe 20 since we started, which is fab because we are honestly both delirious right now. This drive is taking, I'd say about 40 minutes, no, 50 minutes longer than it would normally. So. We're both starving, we're both slightly delirious and we couldn't play I Spy anymore, so this is where we got to. And I started like trying to, we were playing Who Am I, but like broad spectrum. And at one point I was like picking Phil Mitchell, I'm that delirious, so <laughs> we think we've narrowed it down. Um, so yeah, that is gonna be us for the next 31 minutes. And I will check in with you when we get there. We have arrived, off you go. Hi! I'm a perfect friend! Hi! Oh, you are the dream! As is his mum. Hello. Oh, babe, I'm already sweating, it's so hot. It is really hot, it is lush. I love that we've all come though in like beige. We have. Well, you guys have turned up. We were here already. <laughs> we're all in like beige -y cream tones. This is really cute. Where is it from? Thank you. It's a collaboration between Casa Reiki and Candice Lake, who's an incredible photographer. And it just, it's just. It's really gorgeous. Gorge. It fits so nicely. I like the cinched in waist, yeah, it's cute. Too. Really cute. The garden looks insane. Yeah, but have you seen the hydrangea? Oh, let's have a look. Oh my god, honestly. Look, it's look, so look, beautiful. The they, they've doubled in size since last year. Yeah, this is they incredible. Really but they started, they were literally, the gardener has to cut them down to like here. Yeah, I remember when they were so little. It's amazing. Oh, I'm real. Climbing roses. Climbing roses. Oh, oh, climbing roses. They're so beautiful. Oh, I just wish the hydrangeas were out for you. Oh no, they'll be out soon. They'll be out by they'll your be out birthday. For my birthday. Yeah. Birthday party. Can I see the veg patch, please? Yes, yeah, can I see the veg patch. Oh, this little seating area. Oh, yeah, your garden is my favourite. Trees died. Oh, the frost. poor trees. So we're we'll just waiting for one more. Um, in here, well, I mean, these are thriving. We have carrots, beetroot, and parsnips. Stunning. That are loving life. This side, we have some kind of like mustard plant, which we planted more of. Ooh, in here, squash. which is great. We've got a little squash, little courgette. Cute. And then up here, we are waiting on these garlics and onions. Oh, we're also waiting on ours. They look a bit like, um, yeah. ugly like this, but yeah. we have loads of onions. We can make curries. Do you know what looks really cute, actually, is runner beans I've been doing this year. They oh, look so beans. cute when yeah. you'd get the little, like, triangle thingy. Yes. So yeah. cute. And you so can them off of the thing, right? Yeah. yeah like that. It's so, so sweet. Like that Ooh, is and this then lettuce? We have some rhubarb and we have some lettuce in Lovely. different colours. But we've already been cutting it back lots. And Love. then my spinach isn't doing great. Oh. But my favourite. Can't win them all, babe. Is my little herb garden. This is so sweet. I just thought it was the a really good bee. use of this. I know. Mm, so we've it's got so gorge. basil, thyme. Coriander is absolutely on some kind of speed. It's <laughs> Rosemary, sage, and then oregano. Who knew oregano looked like this? I actually didn't. Mine I doesn't didn't. look like that. Yeah, I know. Mine's it's... much smaller. Yeah, well, mine was too. It's down here, and then these have grown the past week. Oh, mad. So, yeah, look how cute oh, this is. Though. Stunning. I'm really pleased. Well done, babe. So lovely. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, little <gasps> The dream. I love these little arches as well. Oh, They're so pretty. My jasmine. So cute. So, yeah, so I've got our little seat so we can sit out. <gasps> the dream. And we've made watermelon oh. juice. Every, every, like, angle is just beautiful. Thanks, it's beautiful from all the angles. I love it. That makes me so happy. Should we go get a drink with the boys? Yes. <laughs> we've made watermelon juice. <gasps> yes. Well, Amazing. Unreal. And a bit of, uh, lime, maybe? Oh, delish. Yes. Delish. It's just very hot, though, isn't it? Yeah. This is Ryan's stunning two-piece. We are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you guys, we are, we are drizzling. This is the best bit. Drizzle, bizzle. Oh, it's a perfect consistency, isn't it? Oh, thank you. Oh my goodness, with the raspberries as well. This is why I was up 
at 7 a.m. Because what good friends do, they wake up early to make you lemon drizzle. I messaged Vic being like, I'm exhausted if I just involuntarily fall asleep. Like, this is why. And she was like, go back to bed, go back to bed. And I was like, I'm making the lemon drizzle. And she was like, no, it's fine, you can nap later. To be fair, we can put blankets out on the grass and then we can all lay down with our drinks and have naps. This is like a literally basting a chicken right now. <laughs> this is my version of basting a chicken because yeah. I will never ever be caught dead basting a chicken. <laughs> That's right. Definitely. This is, oh, babe, you've honestly outdone yourself with this. Oh, thank you. Like the shape of it, it's very it's like country loaf. What would Paul Hollywood say? Paul Hollywood would be like. He'd probably tell me it's no, too no, sweet. No, he wouldn't. I was going to say, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Do you know what? Everyone's like, yeah, bake off, bake off after I make stuff like this. And I'm like, but all I could do is a lemon drizzle. What time do you call this? I got the wrong time. I'm so too late. I got delayed half an hour. Look at you, you look cute. Can I take something? Oh my god. <laughs> You bought the whole rice cooker. I am obsessed with you. I am obsessed with you. Oh great! Oh perfect. Do you think we like rosé? Yeah, just a little bit. Oh my god. Okay, we'll have this one first. Oh my god, the best spread: jalapeno and dill chips. Uh, so good. Oh my god, these flatbreads are—they are unreal. Well done. Thank you very much. Hats off to the chef, he's a stunning. Oh my god, is that a pizza? It's is that like cheesy? A, it's is that like cheesy? A, it's not a, yeah, it's cheesy. It's oh cheesy my god. With vegan cheese. Oh my god. This is the best day of my life. Stunning. <gasps> no. Oh my god. This is my, my idea of heaven. We, we have got <laughs> vegan burgers, <laughs> flatbread, <laughs> rosé. There is obviously a jalapeno in my rosé. If you know, you know. This is the best day. This is amazing. This is the best the day. The guys are seriously treating us here. They amazing. really are. Yeah. Amelia's been over the on. moon. I'm a, by the way, the last time I had an actual burger with a bun was when I ate gluten. <laughs> a long time ago. Nala has found a new best friend. Nala's given me so many licks today, and she also did this really cute thing where she put her, her like chin like on me. Yeah. And, I was like, and then I squealed. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh, Next scary. Time I'm going to play it really cool and I'm just going to be like. You have to with this dog, honestly. Yeah. You have to play it so cool. I just got really overexcited. She is such a good radar for good people, though. Oh. She, yeah. You can tell when she loves someone. She's really relaxed about them. Between the paws. Mm. I can't go without kitty where I could squish your face. She so is the cutest. Love Auntie Amelia. Do you love me? <laughs> oh. So soft. Best godmother. <laughs> like, oh, what are we looking at? <laughs> Going well. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Night. Good night. Night, Alex. Good night. Okay, no one have any fun without me. <laughs> <laughs> no one have any I'm fun without me. She like, gets no. she gets the worst FOMO. She's literally not shutting the door until she knows I'm in this room. <laughs> oh my god! I you have one lull without me. <laughs> 
<laughs> right. No, guys, I'm actually, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Night. Goodbye. <laughs> This is the best room in Froheim. We stay in a different one every time, but this one is definitely my favorite. It's stunning. Best bit about staying at Froheim is stealing the fragrances. This is so good. I was Googling this last night. I was like, where can I get this? How much is it? I need it. Let's go. I need coffee. I need to see my friends. I have FOMO. Do you have FOMO? No, I just want breakfast. <laughs> I just want breakfast and I just want a wee. <laughs> no, no, they're all downstairs. I have FOMO. Okay, let's go. Oh what have I missed? What, what did I miss? Yeah, no! So <laughs> it's all gone down. I can't catch you. I'm sorry. <laughs> And they're one size, so you never have to buy another. Exactly. You just have to be so careful when you wash them. Oh, really? Do you? Mind. Oh, some of mine. <laughs> some of mine have gone a bit like oh. iffy in the wash. Really? Oh. Well, I haven't found that. Oh, interesting. Okay, well, yeah, I'm really excited. excited. So, this one. I love that colour. That's going to look so cute colours. on you. I just ordered the beige, the bikini and beige. Oh, really? Yeah, for South of France. The rosy one the white one? Yeah. Amazing. On this photo. Okay, well, else, yeah. well, else, well else, I can see a wardrobe. So, I got that and then. Then, yeah. the other week, yeah. I saw this, yeah. and then it came online. Oh, it's just, I know I wow! Already, I know Cute. I already got That's one. so you. But isn't it beautiful? stunning? Oh my it's God, got it's beautiful. beautiful. It's almost like um, a horn vibe buttons. Yeah. And then the perfect little little things. And I'm Cute. pretty sure this is the exact one that Rose Hunterton Whiteley was wearing. Oh. Wow, it's amazing. I'll, I will insert the pic, the inspo it's pic. Warm, I think. Yeah, that is goals. I love that outfit. I loved it too, mm. and I looked everywhere for the exact waistcoat, couldn't find it, and then this came online. I was like, that is it. That's the one. Do you think she had it in advance? Yeah. Yeah. Cute. So this. Yeah. Love so that. that was my own. That's a great haul. My... Oh. <gasps> Stop. Wait, oh what? Gosh. Is that money? That's so good. Really excited by the way. Look, it's so cute. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's so no, funny. Oh, it's when you do that and like spin it through. Yes. It. I'm still so. I know you're not doing it right, but I'm still so impressed. <laughs> do you remember you used to do like the around the world? Yeah, yes. You, like, yeah. I can never do that. Or you'd like flip it at people. If you grew up in the UK, I need to know did you have like salespeople come to your. Which I can't believe now is allowed, but did you ever have salespeople come to your school and in assembly they'd crack out like a skipping rope or yo yos and they'd try and like. Skateboarding dog. What? We had a skateboarding dog. A skateboarding yeah. dog? How were they, what were they selling? The skateboard? No, it was just random stuff, wasn't it? In primary school, they used to oh just bring random people in, didn't they? I, just, I, know, I don't know, I feel like they used to let salesmen into our like Sales. assemblies to sell us things. But we used to have like yo-yo yo salespeople come in and like they'd basically do loads of tricks and convince you to go home and tell your parents you needed to buy one of their special yo-yos. Mad. Yeah, I can't believe that was allowed. But did you also have this? I would love to know. Let me know. Shroom. We're going to the shroom. You're in the shroom. Oh. Amelia's doing her makeup. Can I steal this? No, sorry. No? <laughs> Gold dust. No? Are you talking about my lipstick? Can I can I loan some? Oh yeah, of course. I'll give it back to you. But you know, those are such gold dust, and you saw my last one, Suze, that was like oh, really? an absolute nubbin. 
It really was. It's in, it's in the last vlog. Yeah, it was an oven, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. That, that is a stunning lipstick, okay. Also, the Rouge Watermelon Lip Peptide Treatment. Mm. Oh. This, that is a good combo, actually. Okay, I need that. Yeah, yeah it's such, it's She's such so a cute. bloody cool. I'm getting ready in the wardrobe of dreams. I've gone for a really cash little outfit today because it's just so warm and I just, I drank wine last night and I just want to be comfy, so yeah. Oh, yes, please. Yeah. Can I have an iced one, please, with loads of sugar? Love. That is my coffee order. Yeah, so I've gone for a new little Adenola set. I just love their like shorts and sweatshirt sets. I've managed to already get this dirty on the boob, so let's ignore that. I've also got the matching sweatshirt. I had real, uh, not to be dr dramatic and inappropriately use the word, but I have real PTSD over navy blue because it used to be my school uniform colour. But after many years of therapy, I'm over the school years. I love the navy blue tone on me now, especially with my current hair colour. I think it looks really nice. Tortoiseshell pair of sunnies. Like, oh, it's just such a nice vibe. The shaker bag has a like, gold on it as well. Um, and my shoes for today, I'll show you in a second, are going to be my Bottega white padded sliders. So they just work in perfectly with the shorts and the top. Yeah, so that is my OOTD. <laughs> Really giving face. So. <laughs> Love of my life. Oh. <laughs> I'm Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. I love you. <laughs> Guys, I'm on a one week loan. <laughs> See you next week. <laughs> Look at you with your rice cooker. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just very excited for your one month loan. No, really oh, a month. month. A whole month. A month. <gasps> You, you're so good to me. <laughs> Let's just uh, casually slip those in here because I don't have room in here. Three oh. hugs! The dog's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize it was a group one. Like, oh, no. oh no! Oh guys! How nice is that? I'm gonna cry. Are you coming home? Are you coming? <laughs> Bye, best friend. Bye. Love you all. Love, Hold on to the Love you. No, I just don't want to leave. No, she no, really, she does like... not want to go home. Let's stay. I'm oh being my, told oh to God, leave because so otherwise Amelia will get FOMO. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> Amelia's like, you need to go so I can leave. Stunning.